Yo, yo, what up, Team Handsome Guy? It's your boy Ryan here. Welcome to another video. In today's video, um, I want to talk about basically, I got a question to my email box. And the question was, it kind of got a little personal, um, so I'm not going to reveal it all. But basically, it said, Ryan, what do you do like, when life is just kind of shitting on you? What do you do when you're getting hit from every angle? You're trying to do this, but you're getting pulled here, and you're just not able to, to accomplish the things you want to do, your goals. Basically, your life is in chaos, and how do you kind of push through and keep going to achieve your goals and stay just on your path? So, um, he actually got really in depth with a lot of uh, personal stuff in there, so I didn't want to like read it and put it uh, put them on blast at all. So, I appreciate you for sending me those type of questions. And um, yeah, so anyways, first off, I just want to say today is like the first day in Florida that I was able to rock some layers. I filmed a video with Elliot Hulse this morning. Um, he's going to be posting it to his channel. Later on tonight, um, I will maybe do a follow-up video about that, talking about it. But I wanted this sentence to be out to uh, answer my boy's question, which um, I think needs to be answered. Because when there's things going on in your life that you can't control. Now, I can only tell you how I deal with situations because the last three weeks of my life has been a freaking whirlwind. All kinds of shit's been going on. So um, I wanted to reveal something to you guys today that I haven't told anybody yet. Well, I've told people, my friends know, and a lot of people in my personal life know, but you and me, as in my 8,380 subscribers, 30,000 people on my email list, all you guys don't know that I'm about to have a baby. Uh, my girlfriend's pregnant, we're having a little girl. She's due January 27th, so been dealing with all that, getting all the baby shower stuff. Um, we actually found out two weeks ago that we had to, our landlord sold our house. So my girlfriend currently right now is almost eight months pregnant, seven and a half months pregnant, and we just found out we had to move out. So that fucking sucks. So in the midst of launching um, two products, I had um, a live event, Enhanced Guy Experience, that's next weekend. So I'm planning, pre preparing presentations for a 10 hour long live event where I have people coming in, uh, guys like you. Um, they're flying here to St. Pete to see me, so I have to provide a ton of value to make sure they have a badass trip. All while um, creating 17 accessories you can't resist, which if you guys saw that release last week, um, that was done. And I did that all while moving out. Basically, I had to do most of the move myself because my girlfriend being almost eight months pregnant, I didn't want her doing anything because that's just dick to make your pregnant girlfriend or wife do shit like that. So. Long story short, all that chaos has been happening, but I still got shit done. I didn't let that stop me from doing what I needed to do, which is bring money in, um, keep moving forward, keep providing value to you guys. Um, if you notice that emails kept going out every single day, value kept being dropped. I think I've released three or four videos since then. And if you're coming to the Handsome Guy Experience next weekend here in St. Pete, you're gonna have a badass time. So long story short, if you're having chaos in your life and shit's just fucking going crazy, just make right out a plan and keep following your plan. Don't stop, okay? Um, I was working late into the night. I was working, waking up early, and I even still managed to get my workouts and my bike rides done in that time frame because you can't let yourself get sloppy because nobody likes a sloppy dude you're looking all fat. So, yeah, I hope that answers my boy's question because it sounded like he had similar stuff going on. He's trying to start to dress better, trying to get a new job, but he was fired from his job. He's trying to look for a new job, doesn't have money. Hey man, all of us are dealing with all kinds of shit. So no matter who you are, at any given point in your life or time, you're always gonna be dealing with shit that ain't fucking normal or is throwing you for a loop. You're gonna have to deal with that. So man up, do your shit, follow the plan, and just keep taking action, pushing forward. That's all I can say because that's all I do. And with all the crap going on in my life, I'm still managing to get shit done. So it may not be at the pace that I want because things are not ideal as far as the situation, but they still get done. So I want to show you guys my new apartment right now, which is actually really dope. So I'm going to walk you through the uh, front door here. So as you go, you're going to come in the front door here. And I can't switch the screen. This is like more vlog stuff. Um, as you guys know, there's my bicycles. Um, that's actually my girlfriend's bike. Um, stand up mirror. Look at this dope outfit today. God, I, I love this outfit. So flannel, or the bomber jacket. I say layer. It was like 65 this morning. And like, I was like, oh God, it's cold. I can wear layers. But this is the kitchen. I see there's a tripod. This is my little filming wall. Um, walk through the kitchen here. Got my dog, Honey Bear, my dog, Betty. Um, as you see, this view right here 
This is um, Tropicana Field, which is actually where the Tampa Bay Rays play. So this is a really dope view. Um, at night, it lights up. This looks over, overlooks downtown St. Petersburg. This is not exactly the best view because they're building shit right now. Um, but yeah, so that's our view at night and during baseball games. It's going to be insane around here. I'll do some vlogs. That's another thing. You saw me. I started doing week, uh, daily vlogs. I had to stop that because it was fucking a lot of work. I'm going to get back on it, but um, right now I can't do it. So it'll be soon, though. I'll get back on it. Um, this is the uh, future baby nursery. And that's it. Other than the bathrooms in my bedroom, which is a mess right now. I don't want to show you guys that. <laughs> Maybe another day. But yeah, so that's uh, my life as in chaos right now. So I hope that kind of helps you out because, like I said, I know that when my life is going insane, you tend to get stressed out. You tend to, you know, get overwhelmed. And you're like, yo, what do I do? What do I do? Just keep a plan going and do one thing at a time. Also in that time frame, I got my hand tattooed. It's a cool diamond. Um, they want my hand tattooed. If you read the Instagram posts, when you tattoo your hand, it's like the ultimate fuck you to mediocrity in my eyes. And this is an um, insignia that I'm never going to go get a real job, that I'm going to be an entrepreneur and support myself. Um, that was like kind of like for me like a, a huge insignia. And if you check out my picture of it on Instagram, I wrote a really long post about it because everyone wants to know when you have tattoos what they mean. Well, a lot of my tattoos don't really mean anything, but that one means something. So <clears throat> anyways, that's it for the video. We're getting long now, almost 10 minutes. Um, hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, and if you're a, f a, a father down below or, you know, give me some advice, uh, you know, some best advice stuff. I'm about to be a new dad and still going to be team handsome guy and driving tons and tons of value. But yeah, life's in chaos. You got to keep going. You got to keep doing shit. So that's it. I'm done. Peace.